Welcome back to your place of value. In this video, we wrap up the fourth pillar of financial planning, which is liquidity. You can see the other videos where we spend much time on critical illness, life insurance, and retirement. Yes, so what is liquidity? This speaks to the ease at which an asset can be converted into cash for your use. You should be able to access your money with short notice in the event of an emergency. So what comes to mind when I speak of liquidity? Well, today I'm going to discuss four short term storage for your cash. All right. Somewhere where you can put your monies aside and you can retrieve it when you need it. So number one, I'm sure the first thing that comes to mind is the savings account it's the easiest place to put your money but of course in a bank account guys there is little or no interest that's there it's a hole in area and so this is where i would say you know my monies are hijacked in a savings account because when i look around there is there's multiple ATM machines ready for me to pull my monies out to empty the account so that's one area and there are three others that I want to share with you um, your policies your life insurance policies has cash values on it and uh, with the ease of online access now to your life insurance policies that you can access your cash on a daily basis all right or as you need it you can access your funds but guess what this is a place where your money is accumulating tax-free for you because as an insurance company the tax can we are not we are exempt from the withholding tax that's charged on interest and so your monies are accumulating tax-free so that's your cash values on your life insurance plan readily available to you to withdraw at any time now the unit trust is another example unit trust my friends they will have a, an accumulation period within which there will be no tax on your funds if your monies are left in the account for that minimum period of course you would have seen it maybe in your email because there are public figures public information the sigma global funds and the other sigma funds at Sagicor, they are doing quite well even though it's COVID. So I'll tell you that the Sigma Global Bond is at 11.4%. The Global Corporate is at 10%. Sigma Money Market is 7.9% and the Real Road Fund 5.4%. Yes, so and a unit trust plan, unit trust is an option for your funds. If you have short term cash, that you don't need the funds right now, you'd love you to put it for long term, but that's an option for you. Now, depending on your risk appetite, because here now is a risky suggestion, which is investing in stocks. So, the stock market provides an option. However, you must allow a few days to convert into cash. So if you need your funds, you must put those units up for sale and depend on the market um, forces if there is high demand for your stock, then it will be sold it could be the same day, within the same week, all right? But you don't go into the stocks unless you have the appetite to take such a risk. Okay, so there you have it, guys. So since every day we are busy working for money, it's time to have our monies work for us. I believe that is fair, don't you? Well, that's it for today's video. Please leave a comment like do subscribe and share with someone else let others know about this channel value to value creation and have a good evening see you next time